Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Quest VIII in the last part. We found out that we had to go to Wisher's Peak to, uh, you know, get a wish for the King of Ascantha. And we found out that this place has a lot, and I mean a lot, of multiple enemy battles. <sighs> Not looking forward to that. What? 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 I just went up that. Come on, man. What the heck? But, I'm gonna go right here now, open my menu. <laughs> okay. And use some holy water. Now, the treasure is right up there. I'm guessing we're gonna have to go all the way around. And somehow get that treasure. Treasure! Oh my gosh. H.C. Bailey rubs off on me way too much. <laughs> He's amazing. Spells, uh, whoosh. I suppose. On the Bodkin Boyers. Why would I do that? I'm an idiot. Man, I'm not thinking straight today. It's been almost three weeks since I've played this game. Uh, yeah, this is all in one recording session, by the way, the past three episodes. And, uh,. I plan to make four or five episodes today, so maybe ten. <laughs> Seven or eight, maybe. Who knows? All I know is I'm going to make a lot of episodes, just so I don't run out anytime soon. And I'll probably start recording something else, by the way. And I'll upload that during the night and this during the day. Uh, because that's what I have to do. That's what I'd like to do, anyway. Um, that'll be my secondary LP, though. This will be my main one. This will be the one I focus on the most. And... Yeah. Templar Shield and puts it in the bag. Templar Shield is great for Angelo. Because he's a Templar. <laughs> and he doesn't have a shield. That increases his defense by 15, 14? Uh, total is 67 armor for him. 74, 55, and now 68. So, yeah. It's great, it's great. I need to get a, some good stuff on uh, Jessica, though. Because she's, she's slacking. Well, let's go up here. Let's see what's up here. I'm guessing it's the top of it. Because, yeah. Alright. Yeah, it is. I don't think you can encounter wild or battles here, so. Yeah. But, as you can see, the moon is rising, and this shadow right here is growing. You just have to wait till this shadow hits the wall over here. And so it'll be a few minutes. And I will, uh. I guess. I guess I can speed this up, or I don't know. I'll just talk to you guys while this is going on. Anyway, how's it going? I don't know what time this is gonna go up. So, how was your day? What's been going on with you? My uh, new LP should be coming soon. I don't know what it's exactly what it's going to be. I, I have a feeling though, um, and it'll be pretty cool. It'll be for PC, so I don't have to edit it all that much. I don't have to uh, do all the sorts of stuff. And yeah, here's the uh, here it is. Didn't have to wait too long. So nice. Notice how the shadow doesn't move from the wall, even though you're in front of it. 
It's kind of weird. Even though the shadow's on your back, it's still on the wall as well. Which is pretty cool. I don't know if the developers made it like that, or... What? And you don't have a shadow either. Now, this voice actor right here... Prepare to want to shoot your own brains out, because this is awful. Okay, <laughs> this guy's a voice actor makes you sort of want to go die. Which I don't, uh, I don't condone in any way whatsoever, I'm just saying. I am Ishmari, keeper of the Moon Shadow Land. <laughs> Welcome to my realm. Please stop talking. Yeah, this guy loves to play instruments, as you can tell. Instruments all over the place, and he doesn't even have to play them. He can just set them down, and they'll play themselves, apparently. I mean, look at all these weird horns, and trombones, and tubas, and... I don't even know, man. I wasn't in band. I think those are tubas, though, or brass horns. Uh, something like that. Harps. His favorite's the harp, I do believe. But hey, how you doing? Speaking of music, I'm trying to learn how to play the Many piano. Moons have waxed and waned since human foot last trod this earth. Weary travelers, I welcome you now to the land of the moon shadow. Okay. Enlighten me. What desire? Dang it! I didn't mean to do that. So, Pavan longs to be reunited with his dearly beloved Sasha. I'd say so. You stand amazed, mouths agape in wonderment. Ah, forgive me, I have yet to uncloud your eyes. Children of the light of day, do you believe that memories are yours alone? Well, I... yeah. You're pretty clothes, sure. Houses, tables, and chairs. The sky, the land. They, too, remember each passing day. Silently, they sleep in a dream world of memories. The moon's light may give shape to these dreams. These memories. I cannot stir this daughter of the sun from her eternal sleep, but perhaps I can end your friend's waking nightmare. Lead me to the castle. Lead me to the scene of Pavan's misery. Ishmari joins the party, and uh, if you use him in battle, he'll kill everybody one hit. Just kidding. I have no idea. <laughs> That'd be kind of an overpowered grinding tool, if you ask me. But you have to you know, let him float behind you or whatever he's doing. Because, you know, he's stupid. New Lord opens the moon shadow door. Or the moon shadow's shadow or something like that. I didn't read it. Lead me to the castle. Lead me to the scene of Yvonne's misery. What the heck? I'm already in here. And that guy was dead on the floor. What the heck? Is Dulmagus in here? Please don't have... <laughs> Please, the king better not be dead. This town doesn't need another death. He's dead. They're not dead. They're... They're sleeping. A few, a few. I guess I have to go up this way. Probably because a cutscene happens. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, grieving soul. 
May the moon's rays trace the scenes enacted here long ago. Is wrong. What? <laughs> what is wrong? Sasha. I've missed you so. These two years I've thought of nothing but you. Ever since you passed away. <laughs> You're not still fretting about this morning's missive, are you? You mustn't. You made the right decision. You're always so lenient with people. But sometimes you need to be firm, too. That's a king's duty. Everybody believes in you. You must stand tall and proud. Ascantha is your country. Oh, yes. I have news. The innkeeper's dog has had a puppy. He wants us to think of a name. Is that... me? Yes. I remember this. It was the spring before last. So, this is a memory from the past? <laughs> a puppy, you say? What do you think? No doubt you've already thought of a good name for it. <laughs> it's a secret. Why? If you've thought of a name, then I'm sure it's splendid. Tell me. Surely you have a suggestion too. A name for this puppy. But I'm sure yours is... Shush, Nalpavan. I think any name you came up with would be simply perfect. My dear king, you're a wise and kind man. You should follow your own instincts. <laughs> <laughs> I was planning to use the name you thought of. That's all I decided. <laughs> yes. She was always like that. Sasha. Why? <laughs> Sasha, why are you always so strong? Because my mother gives me strength. Your mother? But she passed away years ago. I never told you, but I was very timid as a child. So weak and afraid. And every day, my mother would try hard to encourage me. When she died, I was so sad and lonely. But then I realized... If I went back to my old, weak self, I would have nothing left of my mother at all. It would be just as if she had never existed. I realized I had to be strong, that I must remember her words of encouragement and everything she taught me. That way, she'll live on inside me for always, forever. Sasha. You're right. I should be more like you. <laughs> Shall we go out onto the terrace? The weather's so nice today. It would be lovely to enjoy the breeze together.
Oh man. Whenever I first saw this cutscene, I wanted it to kind of. It's emotional. It's touching. It's very touching. Look, your country stretches before us as far as the eye can see. Oh, Ascantha is so beautiful. Yes. Beautiful, Sasha. So beautiful. My darling king. For people to live their lives happily. I remember. Everything you ever told me lives on inside my heart. Forgive me, Sasha. I finally opened my eyes. I'm sorry for being so sad and lonely. At last, I finally awoken from my long and terrible nightmare. Well, yay! That's what we set out to do, didn't we? Never again will I forget the things Sasha told me. <laughs> it felt like a dream, but I believe in what I saw. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thanks to you and Emma, I've finally woken up from an unbearable nightmare. Now, I can be a proper king to my people again. I cannot thank you enough. If there is ever anything I can do for you, please do not hesitate to ask. I swear, I will do anything in my power to repay you. Anything at all I can do to help. Farewell, my That's friend. A, uh, May fortune ride with you on your continuing journey. That's a big gift. I hope we will meet again soon. I'm not sure what he says if we talk to him again. Well, I'm afraid I haven't heard any talk of like passing through Scantha. That's not much you see, I know. And there there I was just now saying I wanted to help you. I'm sorry. That's alright. That's okay. Anyway, guys, I hope the uh, talk of a new LP doesn't scare you. I just, uh. I won't uh, take any time off of this one. I'll just upload it if I don't have any of these videos to upload. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video. Peace out, guys.